In this video, I would like to show you how you can make very neat symmetrical increases for the rib one by one, maintaining the pattern of alternating knit and pearl stitches. This is how it looks close up. And the increases are symmetrical on both sides of the knitted fabric. This is the right side. And they look the same on the wrong side. So this method can be used for the double-sided items when the wrong side and the right side are both visible. The stitches are neat and snug. When I stretch, we cannot see any holes. I make a neat stitch, then insert the left needle tip back to front under the bridge between two stitches. Bring the working yarn to the front of work and purl into that loop. Next, insert the right needle tip into the loop of the stitch below and lift this loop onto the left hand needle like this. Knit into the loop from left to right. And purl the purl stitch. And now we have alternating knit, purl, knit, purl stitches. I'll work a few more stitches of the rib and we'll do this again. Make a knit stitch, insert the left needle tip back to front under the bridge between two stitches. Bring the working yarn to the front of work and purl into that loop. With the right needle tip, lift the stitch of the row below and place it onto the left needle tip. Knit into that loop from left to right. And purl the purl stitch. I'll work a few more rib stitches and we'll do this again. Make a neat stitch, insert the left needle tip back to front under the bridge between two stitches and purl into that loop. With the right needle tip, lift the loop of the stitch below and place it onto the left needle tip. Knit into that loop from left to right. 
and purl the purl stitch. A few more stitches of the rib. And one more time. Make a knit stitch. Insert the left needle tip under the bridge between the stitches back to front. Then purl into that loop. Lift the loop of the stitch below. Place it onto the left needle tip. And knit into that stitch from left to right. And purl the purl stitch. And I'll finish the row. And show you how it looks. So we have four increases one, two, three, four. I'm going to need a few more rows of the rib until I make enough to show you how it looks. So these are the increases for the rib one by one. They maintain the rib pattern, alternating knit and pearl stitches. They are symmetrical on both sides. And when you stretch, there are no holes. The stitches are snug and neat.